For more information, visit our website and blog www.mathswithnasir.com and www.mathswithnasirblogspot.com. Thank you. Think or discuss page number 179, chapter 7, coordinate geometry. The line joining points A6, 9 and minus 6, 9 is given. In what ratio does the point P, 2, 3 divides AB? Let point P, 2, 3 divides A6, 9 and B, minus 6, minus 9 in the ratio M1 is to M2. Let coordinates of point P as X is 2 and Y is 3. And A point coordinates as X1 as 6 and Y1 as 9 and x2 as minus 6 and y2 as minus 9. We already know that p divides the points a x1 y1 and b x2 y2 in the ratio m1 is to m2 then the section formula is given by p x comma y is equal to m1 x2 plus m2 x1 by m1 plus m2 comma m1 y2 plus m2 y1 by m1 plus m2. So we can write after substituting the x y and x1 y1 x2 y2 values it can be written as p of 2 comma 3 is equal to m1 into minus 6 plus m2 6 by m1 plus m2 comma m1 into minus 9 plus m2 into 9 by m1 plus m2 m1 into minus 6 is minus 6 m1 m2 into 6 is 6 m2 m1 into minus 9 is minus 9 m1 m2 into 9 is 9 m2 so now to find m1 m2 values we have to compare x coordinates or y coordinates now we compare the x coordinates then we can write it as 2 is equal to minus 6 m1 plus 6 m2 by m1 plus m2 now we transpose m1 plus m2 from denominator to lhs then we can write it as 2 into m1 plus m2 is equal to 6 m1 plus 6 m2 now using distributive law we can write it as 2 into m1 plus 2 into m2 now we transpose 2 m2 from lhs to rhs and minus 6 m1 from rhs to lhs to simplify the equation 2 m1 plus 6 m1 is written as 8 m1 and 6 m2 minus 2 m2 is written as 4 m2 now we transpose m2 from rhs to denominator of lhs and we transpose 8 from lhs to denominator of RHS. then we can write it as m1 by m2 is equal to 4 by 8 now we cancel 4 1s are 4 and 4 2s are 8 then we get 1 by 2 therefore m1 by m2 is equal to 1 by 2 now we write in the ratio form as m1 is to m2 is equal to 1 is to 2 therefore the point of 2 comma 3 divides a b in the ratio m1 is to m2 is equal to 1 is to 2 think discuss page number 179 chapter 7 Coordinate geometry. The line joining the points A6, 9 and B-6, 9 is given. In what ratio does the point Q-2, 3 divides AB? Then let if Q-2, 3 divides point A6, 9 and B-6, 9 in the ratio M1 is to M2. We have to find the ratio M1 and M2. We already know that if a point P x comma y divides the points A x1 y1 and B x2 y2 in the ratio m1 is to m2, then we can write the section formula Q of x comma y is equal to m1 x2 plus m2 x1 by m1 plus m2 comma m1 y2 plus m2 y1 by m1 plus m2. After substituting the values of x1 y1 x2 y2, then we can write q of minus 2 comma minus 3 is equal to m1 of minus 6 plus m2 of 6 by m1 plus m2 comma m1 of minus 9 plus m2 into 9 by m1 plus m2. Then we can write it as after multiplying m1 with the minus 6 we get minus 6 m1 and m2 into 6 is written as 6 m2 and m1 into minus 9 is written as minus 9 m1 plus m2 into 9 is written as 9 m2 to find the m1 and m2 value we have to compare x coordinates or y coordinates so here we compare the x coordinates then we can write it as minus 2 is equal to minus 6 m1 plus 6 m2 by m1 plus m2 now we transpose m1 
plus m2 from denominator to the LHS then we can write it as minus 2 into m1 plus m2 is equal to minus 6 m1 plus 6 m2 by using distributive law we can write minus 2 m1 plus m2 as minus 2 m1 minus 2 m2 is equal to minus 6 m1 plus 6 m2 now we transpose minus 2 m2 from LHS to RHS and minus 6 m1 from RHS to LHS after transposition equation is written as minus 2 m1 plus 6 m1 is equal to 6 m2 plus 2 m2 and by simplifying minus 2 m1 plus 6 m1 we get a 4 m1 in LHS and in RHS by adding 6 m2 plus 2 m2 we get a 8 m2 now to find m1 is 2 m2 we have to transpose m2 from RHS to denominator of LHS and next we transpose 4 from LHS to the denominator of RHS then we can write it as m1 by m2 is equal to 8 by 2 now we cancel 2 1s are 2 and 2 4s are 8 then we get 2 by 1 in RHS m, therefore m1 by m2 is written as 2 by 1 then the ratio of m1 is to m2 is given as 2 is to 1 therefore the point q minus 2 comma minus 3 divided save in the ratio m1 is to m2 as 2 is to 1 think and discuss page number 179 chapter 7 coordinate geometry d1 in how many equal parts is a b divided by p and q from the above we can say that point p 2 comma 3 divided a 6 comma 9 and b minus 6 comma minus 9 in 1 is to 2 ratio and point q minus 2 comma minus 3 divided a 6 comma 9 and b minus 6 comma minus 9 in the ratio 2 is to 1 think discuss page number 179 a bit what do you we call p and q for a b the point p 2 comma 3 divides a b in the ratio 1 is to 2 and q minus 2 comma minus 3 divides a b in the ratio 2 is to 1 then we call p comma q as the point of trisection of a b please like share subscribe our channel for latest updates by pressing the bell icon for more information visit our website and blog www.mathswithnaseed.com and www.mathswithnaseedblogspot.com thank you